so I'm back for a, another video Happy New Year's Eve or Happy New Year's and today I'm going to be reacting to Jonathan Young's version of the Oogie Boogie Man and this version is a metal version which is Jonathan's Realm so let's get started take I got a very you just got kidnapped by a madman which I know a lot of Jonathan's villain covers are kind of that you know I'm going insane if you watched Hellfire he does a great job as Archdeacon or uh, Judge Claude Frollo using his mind over Esmeralda um, it was a little interesting that there were two Santas, the guy, Lee, that was just like sitting there, you know, the kidnapped person, and then there was a stuffed puppet. Uh, I found that to be actually a little weird that the stuffed puppet was um, saying all of Santa Claus's lines, and the guy was just sitting there. Um, that was a personal preference. I do like how they had a live action Santa Claus there. Jonathan Sunging is great. It's definitely that metal. I wish like he had explored a little bit more of his voice. Um, a certain section when he goes, whoa, you might have seen me go, whoa. And that might have just been from voice plays. Um, version of this but the echo of the whoa I think would have been nice in this version um and my only other critique is the end you're not going anywhere um that kind of ended a little bit more abruptly than I would have liked I wish Jonathan had uh 
kind of held out the note a little bit more. Uh, I forget how it is in the movie, if it's just an abrupt, and you ain't going nowhere, or you ain't going nowhere, boom. But um, I love the simple design. I love how Jonathan is actually not dressed up as really a stereotypical oogie boogie. Um, kind of his more down to earth normal costuming is an interesting take because it can represent that Oogie Boogie can actually be absolutely anybody. Um, like if they were in real life, it could just be, you know, a director or somebody you know. So that was nice. And I like how the Santa Claus is kidnapped in a uh, lights uh, rope instead of like a traditional, you know, the rope that holds everybody. So that was interesting. Um, so yeah, a very good take. Uh, was I love Jonathan? I really do. But just some songs, it doesn't seem to fit him. I do applaud him for trying to do a metal version of this. Um, but it it got the remnants of a madman, which is good, but it didn't I don't know, him as Oogie Boogie doesn't I don't wanna say it doesn't fit because, you know, there's no guidelines on to how to play Oogie Boogie. But just this cover got the villainous feeling, but it didn't feel like it was really in place. Jonathan, if you're listening to this, I do love your music. You are a very, very good singer, and you have great potential for any role that you play. I just don't exactly prefer this version, but I will listen to this version again, definitely. So, I'm sorry if it seems like I'm against Jonathan in this video. Some of you guys are saying I could be too harsh. Uh, I don't really understand how Jonathan does his music. But, I know he's more known, or at least I know him through his villain covers, like Claude Frollo, um, uh, Scar, be prepared, that's a really good version. Uh, Gaston, he did the mob song. So, yeah, Jonathan's great. I just don't exactly think he fits as Oogie Boogie. Just because Oogie Boogie is more of that, uh, it's kind of more to me of a jokester that is pranking a little bit too hard. And this is actually a critique of Jeff from a uh, voice play. I feel that Jeff didn't exactly get that part of the jokester playing a prank too hard point either. And as I said before, there's no guidelines of playing Oogie Boogie, but I just I guess what I look for when I look for somebody playing Oogie Boogie is that kind of prankster that either does not know that his prank is going a little bit too far or kind of what Jonathan was going for, which is you got kidnapped by a madman, but you don't know exactly how doomed you are, if that makes sense. But I do love this cover. Jonathan gets a round of applause. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and have a great day, everyone.